Welcome to SQL reporting service video number 44 in this video we're going to look at how do you uh, do the total and math and do the average and all you know in the matrix reports so what we saw last time in the report was this the story was there are a certain set of employees who are making a sale for a certain set of products for our company and we are displaying how many quantities are sold by them over the time right so this is the basic count we have right now so what I would like to do is I would like to know like how many total quantities sold by Andrew for all the products what he has sold so I should get a total you know below this uh, I think I have to put in the restore mode to show you so below this I'm expecting the same right at the very same time horizontally one second I would like to know like you know how much sell was there for a specific product like Alice Mutton how much sell was there so I would like to see on the right hand side I would I wish to have a column around that so let's do that uh, and let's before doing that I would like the new joiners to see what we have done in the past what we have done is like you know we have prepared the query and the query was pretty simple drag the four tables onto the surface click on product name quantity and the employee who is selling the product okay and the order date to just to see and what date uh, the sell was done right so that's the query about apart from that you know this is the data source which actually points to this guy this guy actually points to my SQL server and via which it does the job right so now and after that what we have done is like I got this product name I dragged into the row section then employee name I've dragged into the column section and the quantity into this section in order to get a result like this okay so next what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on the sum quantity I'm gonna do the escape then I'm gonna do the right click I hope you can see the row add total which I'm doing here and I'm gonna do the row so it adds a row beneath my sum and the same now let's do the preview first to see if it is working out so let's do the preview and at the bottom you can see this is the cell done by Andrew okay and so is it done by the other employees 7852 this guy looks the highest has to be a girl yes it's Janet okay no problem next thing right click again add total and now this time we'll do the column so on the right hand side you get the column and let's do the preview so while doing that on the right hand side I'm getting a total and this total helps me to understand how much sell was done for Alice Mutton over the years and how much was the total how many products were sold right so the first this row gives you an idea like you know how much sell is done by the employee and the horizontal one gives you an idea how many quantities were sold by all the employees so to give you a much more better presentation right so I hope this video gives you an idea like how you can do it it was pretty simple you know all I did is like you know select the cell right click add total I added row and column and it was done plus if you want to, to see if you want to change the expression instead of using you know the sum you can use a built-in math function like AVG if suppose you wish to see like the average so instead of looking at the whole cell you know done by the Andrew I just wish to see what is his average speed of selling the products so last time figure what you saw was 6000 or something this time you are seeing something different right and of course uh, the figures are very disruptive I don't like it it has to be you know decimal place it has to be 1.2 or something like that so we'll fix that in the next lesson alright so I hope you got the idea you know how can you configure this not just average plus uh, I mean 
you can use a lot of math functions you know which are available under the math you can do a lot of which makes you know a lot of sense to your data so I hope you like this video and if this video helps you in some way then please subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends thank you for watching this once again good night and take care